right for Kirby. The new Smash Bros. is coming to the Switch, and more people are forgetting about the buff DDD meme. And, not only that... <gasps> IT'S RELEASING TOMORROW! And because Kirby Star Eyes is coming out pretty soon, I want to make a top 5 list of the best Kirby games to date. Coming in at number 5, we have the original Kirby's Dream Land for the Game Boy. A lot of people overlook this game for Kirby's adventure when they're talking about old Kirby games. Personally, I think this is the golden age of Kirby. And while he didn't have his copy abilities, this is still a pretty great game. It got It's the best-selling Kirby game of all time, and it got lots and lots of good reception. Coming in at number 4, we have Kirby's Dream Land 3. This game is also often overlooked when talking about Kirby games too, especially considering it's the last first party title for the SNES. But it's still a pretty good game, like Kirby's Dream Land. And it has good bosses, good two player co-op, and a swelth of new characters. Coming up next at number 3 is Kirby Planet Robobot. I didn't have much time with this game because my copy was stolen three days after I bought the darn game. But for the time I had it, it was pretty good. And it was actually kind of a substitute for a Kirby Triple Deluxe as I didn't get it for Christmas, but I got this game instead. The game itself is just typical Kirby affair. You just go do some stuff and then you fight a boss, do some more stuff, then fight a boss. But the way Planet Robobot portrays it, it's just, it just seems so special. And there's also lots of other stuff, including the obvious robot costume. But other than that, it's just your typical Kirby affair. Next up at number two is Kirby's Adventure. The best way I can describe it is Kirby's Dreamland, but better. You got the copy ability, and you got more levels, and you got a better boss. It's all good. It's great, and there's lots of replayability. And number one on the list is Kirby's Epic Yarn. I bet I pissed off at least one Kirby fan right now. <laughs> I had received this game brand new in box for Christmas, and as soon as I booted up the game on my Wii, I played it for the whole entire day. Best Kirby experience ever. You can't die, it's great, and there's lots and lots of new mechanics, especially considering that Kirby can't inhale and copy anymore. The creator of this game, Goodfeel, also went on to create Yoshi's Woolly World, which is also another great experience, just on the Wii U and the 3DS. And because Star, um, Star Allies is a, a 